Luther was one of many who left monastic life during the 16th century. In 1525, he got married, and his marriage was to Katharina von Bora, Catherine von Bora, a former nun who had left her convent a couple of years earlier. When she escaped from the convent, Katie had taken refuge in Wittenberg in the home of the artist, Lucas Cronach the Elder. So it comes as no surprise that Cronach painted color portraits of Lutheranism's leading couple after they were married. Over a period of several years, the Cronach workshop produced several versions of Martin and Katie portraiture, always with each of them in separate but related paintings. In most of these depictions, Luther's figure fills the frame and his eyes look out from the canvas at the viewer of the painting. Katie either stares at the viewer too, or else in the direction of her husband. For years, Luther had been urging that the clergy be permitted to marry. As for the vow of chastity taken even by monks, Luther held that godless vows are not to be kept, and he noted that prohibiting marriage is, as St. Paul put it, a doctrine of demons. When he did decide to marry, he said it was in part to pass on his family name to the delight of his father, partly to spite the Pope, and partly to make a good testimony that marriage is beneficial for all. But Luther grew to love his wife Katie deeply and depend on her as his domestic manager. She had a lot to manage right off the bat, a house full of guests constantly. Luther never complained about it. The couple got as a wedding present the former Augustinian monastery in Wittenberg, where Luther had lived as a friar. It is now called Luther House. Thank you.